Hello everybody, JC Denton reporting for duty. Primary goal right now is to find Nicolette Duclair. She's known to frequent Club Laporte. De l'enfer. I don't know what that word is, but uh, port is like door. So I don't know what de l'enfer is. Make contact with the Illuminati in Paris, which is, you know, basically kind of what we're doing there. So here we go. I guess we're going to take these random... There we go. These sewers can take you anywhere in the Champs-Elysees where you will find the club. I just got an unexpected message from Jaime Reyes. He's at a cafe and wants to see you. He says it's urgent. The cafe address is number 19. Oh, they're robots. Above, I'm showing MJ-12 troops and the Paris police. Also some bots. The police won't bother you, but stay away from the troopers. Okay, that's good to know. Police good, troopers bad. Two picks, damn, really? Oh! Really? Did you see that? That hurt my head. More than anything. Weird. I'm gonna just check the other direction. Whoa. Oh yeah, of course. I swear, this is how every episode starts. <laughs> what if I use a scrambler on this thing? Whoa. Okay, well, now that they're all over here, I'm gonna run to the other side, use two of my last three damn lockpicks. They should all be extremely- actually, you know what, here's what we're gonna do. Oh no! <laughs> I only have one rocket left? My Lanta. Uh, this is getting difficult. You start using these white phosphorus, probably. A lot of you guys have been questioning, why am I carrying this Zyme? It's a good question. I don't really know why I'm carrying the Zyme. I just feel like... I mean, maybe I could buy stuff from drug dealers with it or something. It's like, you know, same reason I'm carrying gas grenades that I never use and EMPs that I don't use. Same idea. So, you know, that's, that's, that's my reasoning. Since I only have one rocket left, I may actually need that to save my face. Just gonna use the damn lock picks, get it over with. Oh, are you kidding? This is not cool! There. Have fun, boy. Oh, shit. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Really? Oh, really? 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 Okay, well, here's what we're doing. I'm gonna grab this lockpick and go out the other way. Where you will find the club. I just got an unexpected message from Jaime Reyes. He's at a cafe and wants to see you. He says it's urgent. The cafe address is number 19. Okay, now we'll go back to the other I'm side. Showing MJ-12 troops and the Paris police. Also some bots. The police won't bother you, but stay away from the troopers. And a uh oh. I'm yep. not sure what you might find in these buildings, but if you break an inner, be prepared to deal with the Paris police. Come here, dog. I dare you. Okay, feeling better. 
So if I go into these buildings, police are going to come at me. Is that what he's saying? And it's martial law, so there's like a combination of police officers and SWAT team guys. You oh, 13. The you only want to stay open during martial law. They've hiked up the cover, but you will have to pay if you want to find out if Nicolette is inside. So I guess the club is 13. Can I ask you a question? I am not paid to advise tourists. <laughs> Take it easy. I just want to know if you've heard of Nicolette Duclair. I have no dealings with uh, Miss Duclair. I sweep the streets. That is my life. But you know her? Where would she be this time of night? I don't have money to waste on that place. Number 13. Club La Porte de l'Enfer. A private club for rich phonies. Number 13. Thanks. If you want Renault, he's in the bar at the hostel. Great. What would I want with Renault? Exactly. You aren't who he was going to hire. The professional thief? I'm flattered. Okay, I kind of wanted to see Renault. Hostels bar is looking for a thief. I'm pretty thiefy. I'm pretty stealthy. <laughs> Try to be. This is clear the streets. This guy's grouchy. That little building is a hostel. Lodging for backpackers. Okay, well, that's good. So I can probably go in here then, because I'm not breaking in. Right? Yes. Not a good night to be on the street. Sorry, all full tonight. Where's Renault? Don't need a room, but maybe you can help me find a member of the group's silhouette. Oh, damn it. Her name's Nicolette Duclair. No, I know nothing about that. Leave me alone. That sounds like some bullshit answer right there. Let me just check the computer myself, how about? I think it's bizarre that they don't... It doesn't bother them when you use their machines. <laughs> No emails, huh? Never heard of anything called silhouette. Yeah, I'm sure. Oh yeah, we've read all these. Is this the bar? This must be Renault. Yep. Guy. This guy is frickin' augmented, man. You can probably kick my ass. Hello? <laughs> that is not the voice I expected. Talk to Renault. Hello there. You must be Renault. So? I heard you're looking to hire a thief. The baker at number 15 keeps Zyme. 100% pure. In one of the ovens. What do I get if I help you? 50 credits each vial. The place has booby traps. Otherwise, I would break in myself. Uh, well, I mean, I already have him. Let's see what he says if I say... I don't deal in Zyme. I don't deal in Zyme. A dirty business. I understand. Slavery. Addiction's another form of slavery. Yes, of course. Your hands will not get dirty. Aha! Uh -huh. 65 credits, okay? The most I can offer. I don't like your business. Period. Raise the prices. Please, we have oh, a problem. shit. Fine. No deal. Go away. I don't like your tone of voice. It's time to throw Rono down. Said enough. <laughs> Well, probably should have just sold my Zyme, and this guy needs to die. Come on, come on. Yep. Sorry, everyone. Well, that was fun, Renault. Um, take the th Zyme and shove it right up your butthole. <laughs> but it's, it's too bad, because I wouldn't have minded, you know selling it but it just seemed like not really worth it okay my advice get a room and wait for me off New to travel restrictions consult the papers blah 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 going into 13 see how much we have to pay I hope it's cheap I know they said expensive but what La Porte de l'Enfer Resistant members aren't the only ones fond of the discreet staff and plentiful shadows. Watch your back. There is no way that I'm doing three lockpicks to get in there. I will find another way in.
like going right up these stairs. Or what's back here in this sketchy little building? These flats go for about five thousand, almost as bad as Hong Kong. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go. Are you kidding me? I wonder. I don't know if these all connect or not, but I'm hoping. Wow. You know what I just realized is there, there hasn't been one place that's just like, hey, come and buy inventory. It's always been like random people offering you random shit. And very rarely lockpicks, which I would totally buy. Alright, well here comes the lockpicking scenarios. I guess. I gotta do it. I gotta get in here. This is crucial. What would happen if I didn't have any lockpicks or rockets to blow this door down? Then what? You work here? The bartender will help you. I am the accountant. Just a few questions. Have you heard of Silhouette? So, you're in that game. Don't say a word. I don't want to know. But for a thousand credits, I'll give you the address of an arms smuggler who is out of town. Do you need guns? I do not need this crap. No way. Talk to me again. I am your man. You are useless, quite evidently. Thanks, though. PS20. Oh my jeez, I can't afford to break into anything anymore. Qu'est-ce que je vous sers? Uh, no. Let's let's do this. Has martial law heard business? Heard business? Heard business? You can even get on the metro. How can you get to the club without the metro? I came through the catacombs. Oui, oui. The only way is to crawl on your belly like a stinking rat. That's all we get, stinking rats. Silhouette members, you mean? <laughs> rats. And the Gestapo. And they want free drinks. Uh, yeah, Gestapo, Gestapo, what? Not French soldiers. Some of them don't even speak French. The troops at the Metro? We. Oui, there was a coup. We see the president only on video recording, and sweat is dripping from his mustache because it's obvious. Someone is pointing a gun at his head. You might be right about that. These bartenders, man, full of mind. information. Oh, damn. I don't know what I'm gonna do here. I'm so... everything's so tight. Please, keep your weapons concealed. Okay, let's... let's not screw that up, then. Have a light? I don't smoke. What's your name? I'm a little busy. Here's right my now. flamethrower. Uh, hey, can I ask a favor? I'm out of money. What is have this bullshit? Chips? Broke, huh? I guess you must have snuck in the back like I did. My friends work here. Oh. Then you must know all about the place. Oh, yes. I used to work in the office. I could tell you anything. How about 200 credits? I could give you the code to the safe room. That'll work. Yes, this first. What about Nicolette Duclair? Know her? I don't want to get mixed up in any of that. I stay out of other people's business. Mixed up in what? You know how they used to steal sunglasses from the street cops or run by with scissors and cut off their ties? That kind of thing. Always calling attention to themselves. You mean silhouette? I think they were trying to save Paris from exactly what's going on right now. Funny way of doing it. And pretty dangerous. Once people know who you are, you can be killed. Just like that. Just like Nicolette's mother. Enough! I'm not saying her name again. Okay, well, give me that code, though. Come on, 200 credits. You will find much more than that in the safe room. Sure. It's just a little room with a keypad back where the offices are. The code is 1966. Thanks. Pretty sure I'm getting screwed in this deal, but... I guess this is the back door. Which makes sense now that I see where I am, but... I mean, it was right there. 13. Doom. Oh, hi there. Please be lockpicks. Alright. Yeah, pretty sure I got screwed on this deal.
Credit shit. Hundred. Well, this was not worth it. Nope. But I'm, I got a lot of money, so I'm pretty much good to go in that department. Who is this little dancing? Oh, nurse Hi, dancer. Hi, baby. What's your name? JC. Hmm. <laughs> Mysterious. Jesus Want Christ. You know my initials? Nope. How about you tell me something about the people who come here? Anything you like, Judy. 20 credits. Boom, you got it. Okay. So, who do you want to find? What can you tell me about Nicolette Duclair? <laughs> I see now. <laughs> you are in love, you poor man. She has already given her heart to one of the revolutionaries. I'm not in love. Could you tell me if she's here? You have a look. He has a tough guy look, but you cannot compare to a real revolutionary. They have their own private society upstairs. You will be happier down here. Another 20 credits? Well, what is she going to tell me now that I don't already know? Uh, let's see what happens. Sure. I can tell you about Antoine, the thief. Go ahead. Should I be keeping an eye on my credit chits? He pretends to be a big-time smuggler, but really, he just steals things from the augmentation clinic where his mother works. Everyone's got to start somewhere, I guess. You will find him lurking in a dark corner. I bet he will try to sell you something. Am I telling you what you want to know? Can I have another 20 credits? Sure. Yep. Let's keep going. Sure. Who next? <laughs> Jacques, the accountant? I'm not picky. Tell me about Jacques. He grew up here in the Champs-Élysées. He knows everybody. If you're looking for a particular person... Where do I find him? He is in the office we behind the South this. Bar. What do you say? Another 20 credits? Sure. This time I tell you about myself. Don't care. Okay. My name is <laughs> Camille. I'm a writer. Yeah? What are you doing in a place like this? I'm working on a novel. If I dress up like a nurse twice a week... I make enough money to write the other five days. Not bad. Funny how the traffic of credits brings our dreams and fantasies to life. Every transaction is like a small prayer. If so many men have a thing for nurses, you can be sure someone will be standing right where I am, collecting the offerings. Well, I was buying information. Sure, baby, if you say so. <laughs> but if my novel ever gets published, that would be 400 pages of pure information. Think you would put down the 10 credits to get it? I'm not much into books. Okay, so we got a bunch of, like, what's going on here. So, Silhouette's upstairs. Antoine is a thief at the club who sells augmentation supplies. I do kind of want that. I wouldn't mind some upgrade canisters. Uh, and Jacques, whatever. He told me about the one dude I didn't care about, so. Busy night, huh? Obey the rules and enjoy yourself. Pretty lady, huh? Totally, Arthur. Totally. Alright. Where's this guy in the dark corner? What will it be? A snack for 10 credits? Wine for 120? Know the name Nicolette Duclair? What do you want with Miss Duclair? A private matter. This club has good security. You try something, you won't be arrested, you will be dead. I'm a friend of hers. She would have told me to expect you. <laughs> what do you think of Silhouette? They have the right idea, but they are weak. Do they have much popular support? The people are ready to fight. Foreign troops go down the street every day, not even afraid of being seen. The group that has occupied the Chancellery is called Majestic 12. They control the United Nations and plot against other governments as well. What we need is an army. Silhouette should be organizing resistance, not spreading around slogans everybody already agrees with. Never mind. Okay, where's the dude in the dark corner? This corner is not very Chad's dark and there's dead. not very many dudes. No. The police are making a clean sweep through the catacombs. He can't hide. Silhouette knows what to do in these situations. I told him this would happen. But he would not let go of his Voltaire delusion. Maybe he is a Voltaire. We don't know. Was Voltaire. Alright, I heard that. I have some good news for both of you. Chad's alive. 
You seen him? Where is he okay? An American accent. What business do you have with Silhouette? My business is with the terrorists who control the French government. They're planning the same in my own country. What would La Mort du Terre want with America? The French army had nothing to do with the coup. It was an international paramilitary group called Majestic 12. Hey, what about Chad? How is he? His hideout is secure. I'm looking for a friend of his named Nicolette Duclair. She can lead me to a powerful enemy of the conspirators. Nicolette? Oh, oh yeah, she's here. She... She does not want to be found. You know her? She realizes how foolish it is to antagonize the government and has gone into hiding. Are you kidding me? Chad knows exactly what he is doing. He will be a great hero in French history. A martyr, maybe. Not a philosoph. He's quoted all over the world. Slogans, antiques, no contract social. Ideas take many forms. He recycles the past. It is nothing special to be a reactionary who tries to revive the same old rhetoric. Nicolette is in enough trouble as it is. My friend is right. Nicolette told us not to trust anyone. Uh, so now what? She's in hiding. I'm going to go look for myself still. This looks like a dark corner. Hello, tough guy. You talking to me? You use bioelectric devices, yes? Manufacture steroids in your muscles? Nothing as crude as that. But yes, you would be interested in a bioelectric cell for 250 credits. Yes. I'll take one. You want more? Ask for me, Antoine. Can I buy in bulk and get Another cheaper? Another bioelectric cell? 250 credits. No thanks. Alright, I was expecting something better. Alright, let's get my ass upstairs somewhere, possibly, maybe. Here we go. I love this place! Oh, that's a mirror. This is trippy. Claude? Oh, sorry. My mistake. I'm looking for Nicolette Duclair. So? This is probably you know her. her. I know her name. I know that her mother called her Angel. You know her mother? It's a friend of her mother's I need to find. Angel. That would make her a fallen angel now, wouldn't it? You must be after Everett. <laughs> yeah, Morgan Everett. How did you guess? What makes you think Nicolette would betray one of her mother's closest friends? I helped her friends from Silhouette. Chad will vouch for me. I'm after the people who murdered her mother. You are an assassin or something? When necessary. Go out behind the club. I will talk to Nicolette and perhaps she will meet you there. That's probably her. Uh, where is it here? Meet Nicolette behind club. Yeah, well, we know what that is, don't we? It's weird. Everything is satisfactory, I trust. Well... We remodeled the upstairs. You may have noticed. Many customers wanted... Blah, blah, blah. Huh? Huh? See you guys. Okay, here we are, back at the club. I think. Aha! She decided not to show. I knew it! I am Nicolette. I will help you simply to make trouble for Majestic 12. It's true, they killed my mother. Do you know why? She was an Illuminatus. The only people MJ-12 has ever feared yep, the are the Illuminati. Stanton Dowd said they had fallen from power. How do you know Dowd? I met him in New York. A trusted friend of my mother's. Yes, the Illuminati are wiped out, but Paige still fears Morgan Everett. Where do we find him? One of my mother's many secrets. We'll have to look for clues at my family's chateau. Oh, I see. How does Everett threaten Bob Page? Page was an Illuminatus. For him, intellect is the foundation of power, and that would make Everett his most dangerous rival. But Everett's the one in hiding. 
Both the Illuminati and MJ-12 believe that the most intelligent or enlightened human being will inevitably gain power, ultimately seizing the eye in the pyramid and creating the world for everyone else. Kind of secularized version of natural law. Page has a trained army to protect him. He is still vulnerable. Much of his power comes from secret laboratories, meaning the right person could reverse engineer his whole power base. This is true. Let's hope you're right, and that Everett is everything you say he is. Okay, wait by the chopper, because I have to go wait see what's chopper. his balls. I'm not quite ready to leave. We don't have all night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I'll yeah, be yeah. quick. Okay, so we still have to go and see, uh, I think it was number 19. Alex Jacobson. Yeah, I'm pretty sure somebody said this when I first got here. Tracer Tong. Right here. Uh, he's at a cafe and wants to see you. Address is number 19. So I'm gonna go look for that first. Before we peace out. Robots. Robots everywhere. Clear the streets. Whoa. The government has restricted access to the metro. You'll have to get around on foot. I'm gonna need these robots to, uh... You know, cease to exist. That would be great. I can't afford to shoot them. I'm broke ass. I might have to go into Zyme dealing. Trey Chic. I don't think that would be a cafe. New travel restrictions. Consult the papers. I'm thinking. If I throw a scrambler and he'll start killing other robots, that'd be pretty awesome. So, have fun. Here's another uh, robot buddy for you. There you go. Terminate. Really? Sir, what is your business tonight? Whoa. Uh, oh yeah, this is the main entrance to the club. There's 14. A digital media store. Don't waste your money in those places. You can get anything you want for two credits on the black market in Asia. <laughs> That's awesome. And totally right. Strange. I'm picking up infrared pulses. Why would a bakery need electronic security? Well, Tong, it's obviously a front for fantastic baked goods. Uh, where's this damn cafeteria? I don't think I can lower back whack this guy, so I'm not going to try, but... Is this 19? 15. Let me see if I can yoink this box out of here. Do do do. Nothing on ultrasonics. I'll try low frequency reading. This this guy just sees a floating box moving away. Hell, who am I to argue anymore? I don't have a map of this place, do I? Nope. That would be way too easy. Keep moving. I want to know where building 19 is. Oh, that could be a map. Whoa. 
Nope. Stay in the shadows. It's too bad I couldn't just ask someone. Hey, where's 19? Okay, but what's really weird is like I've been all over this place now. I'm in the light. I'm gonna have to check this Trey Sheik here. So many of these damn robots everywhere. What about back here? Hello. Seriously? Okay, I think we might be onto something. Whoa. Let's hope it's one of these buildings. This guy better have something good for me. Okay, police, police. Yep, we're good. Let's check the ATMs. We have reports of terrorist activity. Stay inside. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. I just want to find my friend. Only a few businesses are open. Not much to do tonight. Yeah, can you tell me where, like, Building 19 is? Ooh, what's this? 17. Oh! Shit! No! You guys, I'm much too fast for you, it's clear. Seventeen? What's this one? Oh, that's also seventeen. Gotta be close here. Nineteen! Son of a bitch. Ah, the Paris nightlife. Have a taste of wine for me, JC. I'm not here for partying, Tong. Get your shit together. Alex? Oh, it's hi oh, it's Jaime. Thought you could run off for a weekend in Paris. I thought it was Alex me, for some huh? reason. Call me nostalgic, but the nightlife seems to have lost its old charm. Yes, but I didn't trust anyone else to deliver this warning. Not even Alex or Tom. What happened at UNATCO? They intercepted a message Alex sent to my home account. Instructions on how to find him in Hong Kong. I hope the message was encrypted. I destroyed my key store. Tong is safe. But they've been tracking you with an AI program. They've sent Ganther to assassinate you in Paris. Icarus. However, you don't have to fight Ganther or any other mechanically augmented agent. Does that mean you know his kill phrase? Yeah. Nice. How do you know about kill phrases? Give it to me. That's thrown 6G information. I found out from Paul. Well, here's some gold clearance information for you. Dug it out of classified medical records before I left. Ganther's kill phrase is La Putin Machine. Nice. La Putin Machine. Easy enough. Thanks for looking out for me, staying at the agency and all. Don't mention it. So if he would have came with us to Hong Kong, this may have never happened. That's pretty awesome. At the sound of your voice, 400 milliamps will discharge into Gunther's midbrain. Poof. Love it. He's our son. We can't have him murdering people from this, this majestic 12. He's not a child anymore. This cult? At least he has a position. He's safe. Any organization with anonymous leadership. They might control Europe for decades. Michelle will have to survive somehow. I would rather he die with the rest of us. Joshua! Joshua! What's going I on here? I help overhearing about your son. The Avis, yes. Majestic 12. Whoever they are. When you have the use, you have everything. Joshua, be careful. 
You don't know this man. I get the shh. I will not hide under a rock. You have nothing to fear. I would like to see the end of Majestic 12 as much as you would. I was just surprised to find a Parisian who has heard the name. Well, my son, you know. I learned what I can about him. What else have you found out? You are one of the revolutionaries, huh? Maybe you can do something with this. Street Station 17 and Werewolf from a card in his wallet. I think it is the login for the guard shack up the street. What about Michel? You'll get him killed. He was the one who wanted to be a soldier. That's harsh, but thanks. Bonjour, monsieur. I thought this was their son. I was like, that kid's really young to be in Majestic 12. Anyways, okay. When, uh, when I come back, we're gonna head to the security station. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be messy. And we'll try to log in with Street Station 17, password where we'll see what we can find on Majestic 12. And then we will go and meet Nicolette Duclair and fly the shit out of here. Thanks everybody for watching. Things are happening. Good times. Bye.